Welcome to second part in continuation with previous video on important questions for junior engineer works and AN exam 30% and 70%. I am assistant of ER. Trivendra Kumar for presenting this video. So let's start today's session. When shall the AN should carry out inspection of each section engineer's office and stores? A. Once in six months. B. Once in two years. C. Once in a year. D. Once in a month. And right answer is once in a year. Progress report on passenger amenities works should be sent by A. AEN to senior divisional engineer. B. IOW to AEN. C. IOW to senior divisional engineer. D. Senior divisional engineer to chief engineer. And right answer is Senior Divisional Engineer to Chief Engineer. Progress report on works under execution by construction units to be sent by 2. A. Chief Administrative Officer Construction to General Manager and PHODs. B. IOW to AEN. C. IOW to Senior Divisional Engineer. D. Senior Divisional Engineer to CE. And right answer is Chief Administrative Officer Construction to General Manager and PHODs. The SSE works shall examine all tools and plants with artisans in A. Once in six months B. Once in two years C. Once in a year D. Once in a month And right answer is once in a month. Service books for Group D staff should be prepared by whom on the prescribed form? A. SR Divisional Engineer Coordination B. AEN C. SSE Works D. Chief OS And right answer is SSE Works. Full form of NBC is A. National Building Committee B. National Building Code C. National Building Corps D. National Board Certification And right answer is National Building Code What should be the per capita consumption for designing the water supply system? A. 100 liters per person per day B. 180 liters per person per day C. 200 liters per person per day D. 220 liters per person per day and right answer is 200 liters per person per day. What should be the minimum height of plinth from the surrounding ground? A. 60 centimeters. B. 45 centimeters. C. 30 centimeters. D. 25 centimeters. And right answer is 45 centimeter. Which code is used for design of structures for earthquake resistant design in construction of buildings? A. IS 456 to 2000 B. IS 816 to 1969 C. IS 4326 to 1993 D. IS 2720 to 1980 And right answer is IS 4326 to 1993 for addition and alteration of any temporary structures whose written sanction should be necessary. A. Aden B. Senior Divisional Engineer C. Divisional Railway Manager D. Principal Chief Engineer And right answer is Senior Divisional Engineer. Thank you for watching this video. This will help you to crack your desired exam. If you have not subscribed yet, subscribe. Share and comment if any.